What's, What's up, up guys? guys? I am Chris. And I'm Lex. And welcome back to the channel. If you have seen our faces before, if you have not, please make sure to subscribe down below and smash on that notification button so you are notified every single time we post a brand new video. So we know we've been away for a few weeks, but today we are coming to you guys with a juicy mukbang plus a big story time to let you guys know exactly where we've been for the past three weeks. So make sure you stay tuned to the very end of the video. Let's get into it. So one of our amazing followers and subscribers who has been with us for a long time decided to give us a challenge of cooking this delicious burger which has a bunch of different stuff in it. So shout out to James, go follow his handle down here on Instagram. He is so great, so amazing. We love you and this is for you. Look at this man, holy way. Holy way. So you guys can see, hopefully, <laughs> That in our burger, we got the patty, we got a sirloin steak, I got cheese, a bit of extra stuff in mine. Bacon, she's got extra. <laughs> and we're still yet to bite into these. What is these? What is these? I don't even know what I'd call these. These are my brand new French fry home creations. Fries. Yeah. <laughs> she made us home fries, and obviously the drinks are from McDonald's. Okay, well. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. Try it with the ranch. She did these with her sweet potato on top. That slaps. <laughs> that fucking slaps, <laughs> dude. Down to what we are really here to talk about today. So we have not posted on YouTube here with you guys in the last three weeks. That is because a lot of stuff has happened and uh, Lex is gonna start off the story, but there have been a few things that have happened to us in these last few weeks that have not only affected our lifestyle, uh, but have also affected our filming time as well as the reasons why we didn't film in general, so. So the start of this story brings us to the first week back at work after the new year. I'm going on our regular hump day, Wednesday, and thought everything was going to be all good, fine and dandy. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> it was not. And on that same day, I was actually supposed to go to Chris's house for Orthodox Christmas. Yep. And um, I think it was about 3, 3.30 where I called you. Mm-hmm. And... I thought he was just going on his break because he always calls me mm -hmm. when he's on his break. Every day at 3 o'clock, mm -hmm. I would call her on my break. She said, hey, honey, what's up? And I said, nothing good. I cannot come over today. And then I got really upset because I was like, what the heck do you mean? Like, <laughs> She thought I was playing around. I did. Well, no. Now, due to this risk, my boss has told me that I had to go home immediately and self-quarantine. And my, I called my parents, obviously, and mm -hmm. they just had everything locked down. Like, you know that scene in Monsters, Inc. with the 2319 with George and the sock on his back? The 2319! The 2319! Literally, <laughs> literally that. <laughs> and I hated it, man. So once I was home, I scheduled a test next day. I don't know why. I know that... They're doing the nose thing, but I still thought they were doing the swab. And I was like, I'll be okay. No, I <laughs> I got the nose thing. And a lot of people are like, oh, it doesn't hurt that much. It's okay. But uh, I, I hated it. Mm -hmm. It hurt so much. But for the person that did my test, she's like, okay, we're going to count you in. And I said, okay, sure. <laughs> she said in the count of three, she said one and just... Stuck it right up your nose. <laughs> and it hurt. Mm -hmm. She but the... put that in and she like swiveled around in there to oh. get everything. I don't even want to know. Luckily, I did not see him um, 
since the Sunday before because the, that Monday he went back to work after the uh, Christmas break that he had. So I didn't need to get a test and nor did my family because even though we had seen him, he hadn't gone back to work before then. So luckily we were okay, but I just remember him calling me and telling me and I just started bawling to my dad and I was so scared because this entire time through this entire pandemic, we were just kind of like, I don't think we'll get it. Like. I don't think we're gonna end up, you know, going anywhere and getting infected. And of course you can obviously get it from anywhere. So it's not like we have been going anywhere and thinking that we're gonna get it because we've been pretty well staying inside unless we need to like go to Walmart and get some stuff. Other than Walmart, I think that's like the only place we've gone. Mm -hmm. But I was still terrified. I don't know what came over me, but I was just like thinking in my head, oh, well like he was here through this time. She was only there through that time. and. I was just trying to calculate it in order to tell myself like it was gonna be negative. I was hoping and praying that he wasn't gonna get it because he's immunocompromised and his family is immunocompromised and I just I just went off. I was I was so scared and mm -hmm. so sad. So after my test obviously I went home and what else are you supposed to do? Absolutely nothing. You stay in your bed and don't go nowhere. Mm -hmm. So I rewatched all of The Mandalorian. So my parents would just bring my food upstairs, like to my room with a door, with a mask and gloves. It was a weird time. It was like he was in jail. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Literally in jail. I had a stool out, out front of my door and they would knock and I'd have to come out and grab my food. And the dirty dishes in the washroom because they didn't want to touch them. <laughs> yeah. Crazy. All that we had to do to stay safe. Yeah. And then lo and behold, a uh, few days later. Two days later. Yeah. Nine in the morning, a uh, test came back and it was obviously negative. But that was probably the worst three days to the start of a new year. Mm-hmm. And I just... <clears throat> Excuse you. Yeah, thanks. Bless you. So during Christmas, we wanted to take a weekend break just to spend it with our families because of the year that we had just had in 2020. And so that's what we decided to do. And you guys all know that because we did post on our Instagram. However, what we didn't expect was for our ring light to break. And before our ring light broke, we were doing a few TikToks here and there because we do have a TikTok account. And if you guys don't follow us, please make sure that you go and follow us there because we post a lot on there all the time, day to day, uh, a lot more than what we do here on YouTube, just cause they're a little bit shorter and a little bit more uh, easier for us to edit. But we decided to start posting a lot more on there in the meantime, while we were looking to get a new ring light. And eventually one of our TikToks just blew up and now it's the main TikTok that we have on there that's hit the most views, the most people, and it's sitting at almost 2 million right now, which is absolutely insane. And we couldn't be more happy at the support that we have from so many of you now. We honestly love and cherish you so much and thank you for becoming a part of our little family that we're making not only on here, but also on TikTok. Because of that viral video, we actually ended up manifesting and waiting and hoping and praying to start gaining a more traction in our following. And now we're actually sitting at 15,000 followers on our TikTok page, so. You guys, it was all because of you, and we just can't believe it. Like, we're... We can't thank you enough. Yeah, we really can't. We really can't. So the new ring light that we ended up getting was the Yesker 18-inch light, and I hope I said that name right. <laughs> Is it Yesker? Yes. Ker. Ker. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it came with a lot of stuff, actually, which we didn't really expect, but... Get, we got the bang for our buck on that. We really did. We'll put the link down below if you guys want to also go get it if you're looking for a new ring light because honestly, it is the best purchase we have ever Worth. made. A lot of people go with the newer light. It's very similar, but it does have its extras to it. So with this light, it's 18 inches. It comes with a dual function for both warm light and white light. And it also gives you the opportunity to charge your phone while it's in the back because it does have a port for that. Uh, and then it does also come with the dual horseshoe as well. So the one that connects to your camera as well as one that can also connect to a stabilizer for your phone, which it also comes with. So it is literally the best purchase that we have ever made in our lives. And now we look 10 times brighter for you guys too. Oh, and it comes with a remote control. So you oh, can do yes. it all from wherever. Yeah. You don't have to go it's behind It's really it. nice for pictures too. Mm -hmm. For the fans. 
Oh, it's like Lady and the Tramp, but a Eddie? potato. Eddie? Mm. Oh. <laughs> um, um, um. Did you like your burger, your grace? <laughs> we also watched Bridgerton. <laughs> We binged Bridgerton. Never mind. We finished, watch. We we finished, finished it. that in like two days. Guys, go watch it. The burger was exquisite. You're great. <laughs> Shall we go work off the calories? Uh, the promenade. Via promenade. <laughs> we're really extra that way. Been, <laughs> I don't think the joke will die. We were born this way. I'm mm -hmm. sorry. <laughs> no, I'm not sorry. What am I saying? But that was the. Uh, the three weeks of January that we've been through. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I'm just listening. Now we have some ASMR. Oh, damn, I was gonna say. <laughs> Today, we're gonna be doing some saloon ASMR with Kristen. What are you doing? Today, we're gonna be doing some ASMR sipping. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys do want to see more content from us we do tiktok lives once a week friday through sunday so if you want to just come and chat ask us some random questions we'd love to just hear from you guys that is it for this video you guys thank you again so much for tuning in we are back on schedule for every sunday do not forget to comment like and subscribe down below and we will see you in, in the, the next, next video, video.